Anyway, this is a picture of the building. It's a 2,400 square foot building. I think we built it like in 2004. This room over here is about, oh, I think it's 500 square feet. I mean, you could get a trailer or some uh, four wheelers. You could get some, you know, put all your equipment in that room down there. I'll walk you through it and show it to you, but I just want to show you the outside of the building. We'll just go through and I'll just kind of give you a simulation of what the building looks like. This is the entryway, obviously. And then what I'm going to do over here on this side, and all this stuff is coming out. I mean, it's just junk. I've got junk everywhere. But we're going to build a little bench here and a little area for lockers uh, where you could hang some stuff, hang your uh, hunting uh, clothes, maybe your hunting coat, so on and so forth, and maybe have a little place to sit down and uh, when you go out for the day. Not necessarily a place to get dressed, but you're going to have little lockers right here. But this room in the hallway leads into the main room that's there, but I'll show you where the bedrooms are going to be first. Got a hallway that goes both right and left, and if you turn to your left, this is actually my office with some of my wife's chairs. It's like a 13 by 15. We're going to put four of the bigger beds in here, in this room. Good solid windows. Then the other bedroom will be here. This will be bedroom number two. But another bedroom here. And with three bedrooms on this end right here. And then we'll go this way. You can't tell a lot. See my boxes there trying to get stuff. This would be the living area as such. And let me try to back away because this is kind of a bigger room. There's some more of my wife's chairs. My wife loves chairs. Anyway, this room will be will be the television set in. I'm going to keep that room right over there because I've got tons of videos and stuff that I'll just lock that door off right there. But it's just a little small closet as such. But uh, this is a rather big room. And I can get you the dimensions of all this. I'm just trying to get you something together to where you guys can come look. And There's a door that goes that way, and I'm going to show you where else it goes. Or what it goes into. You come down the hallway. The kitchen will be to the left. It's not a very big kitchen at all. But it will have a stove. It will have a refrigerator. It will have a dishwasher. It will have a microwave. It'll have a kitchen table in it, and it's not a very big area, but it's certainly some place that you could cook. The one thing I like about it, here's an outside door that uh, I plan to have a barbecue grill on the outside right there, and I'll show you that in a little bit also. But uh, here's my plan. My plan, I've got two bathrooms here. I have this smaller bathroom, and then we have a larger bathroom here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put two showers in here. We're going to build a wall, I mean a door that goes into a shower. And then on this side, we're going to put a wall up by that shower over there. And we're going to move the sink and the toilet. We'll have a toilet, a sink, and a shower on this side. If you're coming back down from the hallway, like, uh, hallway again and coming this way, and I showed you that door a while ago, there's a second door that goes into this room. And this will give you access to the room where the garage door is. Like I said, this I think this is like 600 square feet, and of course we'll get uh, we'll get all this stuff cleaned up and get out of here. But uh, this is a huge room that you could use for your mud room. We haven't decided whether we want to put our racks in the hallway in there for the boots, or maybe just use this room. But uh, I'm not quite sure exactly what I'm going to use this room for, but it's just kind of extra stuff. And of course the garage door there that gets you access into here. Right by the kitchen, and I wanted to show you this. Just access out here. A little concrete slab to step out on. And this be a place where you could, uh, we'll have a barbecue grill out here. Of course, two uh, central heat and air units because the garage place is separate heat and air than the rest of the place. But two doors in and out. I'll have a security system in. I'll have some cameras. And coming back in towards the kitchen. And again, the kitchen is not a real big area, but it's big enough for all two or three people to get in here and do some damage.